I think it's very important that fashion is able to acknowledge its enormous power and influence over people's lives. Better Lives um, has been a point of discussion in the college since Francis Corner arrived as head of college um, and it's given us an all, all an opportunity to really re-evaluate our own roles. Um, it's had a number of different iterations through the different areas of our work um, and for the first time this year we've been able to really take the discussion into a new sphere, thinking about how fashion and psychology um, have a dialogue with each other. As you know, the centre became more established and also the work of Better Lives became more established, I was aware that for me the part that was missing was the area of psychology. That if we are going to encourage people to in a way spend more and buy less, um, that we're going to encourage the industry to promote um, much broader representation of different um, body types, uh, deal with some of the issues around beauty, around ageing, then in a way having psychology within the college and uh, creating a course that was dedicated to thinking about the, the role of psychology within the fashion industry, that this would hopefully begin to give us greater understanding of the issues and how we might actually bring about change. Um, I'm developing two master's courses, one's an MA, one's an MSc um, in psychology in the fashion industries and the aim of those courses is to help students identify problems within the fashion industries um, and then hopefully come up with a solution that can help solve the problem. Well I love the idea of bringing a kind of scientific discipline like psychology into fashion because I think there's a certain kind of thinking, let's just say perhaps the commercial world, business, that doesn't engage with um, uh, emotional output at all. And what I'm talking about really is empathy. Business doesn't know how to empathise. But just maybe the discipline of, of science, um, by looking at perhaps the psychosocial impact of fashion, will help business. The next step will be the graduates in the courses who will be fashion literate but also psychologically literate so they will understand themselves better in a way that they can then understand the behaviour of others better and build better lives for themselves and for their communities.